Team hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Rashad here, coming with another Modern Warfare 2 commentary. And today, I'm gonna bring you some Team Deathmatch on Favela. I'm using the Tar 21 with the red dot sight, and I'm using the G18 with also with the red dot sight as my secondary weapon. Um, my perks are Marathon Pro, Stopping Power Pro, and uh, I believe Ninja Pro. And my kill streaks are the UAV, the Predator Missile, and the Harrier Strike. And then before I get talking right there, I tried to snow a guy was going up there, and I tried to throw a grenade, and I wasn't so successful. It came back at me, so I tried to avoid it, almost killing the on grenade. But I do end up getting that guy out there, getting a, end up getting a headshot. I see a guy coming right there, so I go ahead and knife him. But uh, anyways, um. I don't, I will, um, I do pretty decent, I guess. Uh, my final score in this game is 21 and 7. Um, I get my UAV a couple of times. I get my Harrier and my Predator once or twice. I'm not sure, I can't remember. But, um, yeah, I finished going, I end up going, um, 21 and 7, so, uh, it's not too bad. But, um, anyways, so, uh, I thought I had saw something there, but I didn't make too much of it, but I end up getting killed by a guy with a RPG and I see I'm getting shot at so I try to go back around here and um, I don't uh, end up getting to this guy too late trying to knock him too late but um yeah like I was saying I get my UAV quite a few times and I think I get my predator to air my carrier once or twice um but yeah guys um Previously, I was using a TAR-21 with the heartbeat sensor, but, um, turns out, um, if you, like, have no sensor direction, like me, and, um, if you've, like, watched any of my previous games, or you'll see video games, I mean, um, uh, games to come, you'll see that I have no sensor direction in this game. I mean, I'll, like, spawn somewhere, and I'll go, like, the completely different direction. I don't know why, but that's just how I do it, and, um... I don't know, I guess it's just a, something um, I've done since Call of Duty 4 and I can't break it. It's like a bad habit, I guess. But um, oh well. Anyways, I see this guy on top of the building, so I go ahead and pick him off. And um, I mostly just, like when I play a game, like uh, or play a map, I mostly just stay at the edge of the map. I don't really go out in the middle too often, because I um, get killed very easily. And, um, speaking of the TAR-21, like I said, I had the red dot sight. And I have to say that, um, the red dot sight on the TAR is probably the coolest red dot on this game. I mean, i never seen it before. And, um, I have to say it's pretty cool. But, um, right here, I see my teammates shooting at a guy, so they get distracted like that guy in the building. So I go ahead and, uh, knife him. And, um, yeah, just like, kind of pick out some guys, get some kills, get a few headshots. Um, I'm mostly, like now, I just started using the G18, uh, try to get the red dot sight, and I managed to do that, uh, against the service. So, um, yeah, and, um, in this game, I, uh, see a guy like this guy right here. I get his, I get this guy quite a few times quite a few times I'm dead and um he had a tactical insurgent so I go ahead and smash it I don't know why I did that I should just do it like what I did the rest of the game I like saw him a few times uh I think I saw him three times actually once there just a few minutes ago and um I see him two more times I think he's in here too I can't he's right there and then here's his tactical insurgent so I just wait for him wait till he respawns and I just pick him up and I get my predator missile and I think I call it in right here just give me a second I think I get one or two kills I'm just get one. So I get two kills that's how I get my area and I call it in uh, I don't get any kill with it kills with it but uh, I do I get a few quick kills but um, anyways guys, a little background information about me if you don't know me. I'm 19, 
I live in Mississippi in a city called Olive Branch. Mississippi, uh, Mississippi, you know, there are a lot of stereotypes about people from the South, and some of them are true and some of them are not. But uh, I can tell you one, we are the fattest state in the country. So, um, but I'm not fat at all, I weigh about uh, 155, I guess. I think it's great, yeah. I'm not fat at all, but um, we are the fattest state in the country. The reason being, uh, I don't know what the reason is. We have like a bunch of McDonald's like where I live. I mean, we have one like this uh, five minutes away from me, and then we have one like right around the corner from my house. Like literally, I feel like going to it. We have a bunch of Burger Kings, a bunch of Wendy's. We have a bunch of restaurants. That's probably why we are the fattest state in the country. And, uh, I don't live up to the stereotype. And, um, I have I hear a lot of people say like around me that there's a bunch of racism here. I mean, where I live, there's not a bunch of racism here, but uh, I'm sure it still exists. And if it does, I don't know where. Um, I don't try to surround myself with it. But anyways, um, I'm 19. I graduated from high school last year, class of 09, and I'm going to a small community college in Centralia, Mississippi, which has to be probably the most boring city um, ever. It really is. There's like nothing more to do there. I really hate that city, and I plan on transferring. I don't know if I want to transfer this. Like after this semester or what? I don't know. But, um, I'm still thinking about it. But I'm majoring in uh, pre engineering. There's like a pre program for like, um, if you go to community college, there's like a pre program. You take like all your prerequisite classes at a community college and then you're going to transfer to a senior university. You you would have taken all your basic classes from there and when you transfer, you just take your core classes practice for the major. Um, I plan on being a software engineer. Uh, with my bachelor of science degree in software engineering. Um, video games is my passion. I really like to play video games and um, it's something that I wanna wanna do when uh, I finish with college and stuff. I mean, I like playing video games, so why not be able to get back or uh, make like, fun video games for people to play. Right here. Guy, surgeon, go ahead and take them off. Anyways, like I was saying, um, yeah, my own passion to be a video game maker. Anyways, uh, we win the game. 7500. 21-7 is my final score. Uh, coming in the end of the video. Uh, catch you guys later. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Peace.